Hey guys, how are you? How are you? How is it going? So let's share this with some fun people. I don't want to make it long, but long, right? Just fun. How's it going? So I'm going to do it that. Just kind of. Let's have fun, my peoples. What's up, all? Let's do this. Mm -mm -mm. How's it going, everyone? Be patient with me. I'm just, some people always ask me, can you share the video with me? And we can just do it this way. And so I was just like, you know what? I'm going to share it. Why not? Who doesn't love a good lipstick? I love lipstick. Um, I love all colors. So let's just end it there. So if you're on high, this is not going to be a funny video. It's not. It's just me. I want to show you guys some of our different colors, our new swatches that are, um, they've been reformulated. Um, they're vegan. Um, so I'm going to show you guys more than these colors. I have several. Um, I have so many to show you guys. And you guys can pick the order. So it'll be fun. So my f fun way of doing this is letting you guys see all the amazing colors we have. Um, we have all of these colors so tell me what color is your favorite color I'm gonna start with that what color do you guys like let's let's do it this way share this video because I know there's some lipstick lovers out there so we have a full range of everyday colors or if you want it to be on the bright side and you love bright colors um, share it with um, share it with your family and friends so who doesn't love I love all these colors the great thing is that you can mix them with any color um, they do dry um, matte if you want a gloss you can put a gloss over it um, they last about four to six hours so it really depends um, they can last longer so that is a great thing if you're eating greasy foods obviously it's probably not gonna last but I will tell you that um, this red right here cherry pie has lasted me for over like six seven hours and mind you I love to snack who doesn't love to snack I love snacking on chips I love chips so what color you guys comment below what colors do you guys like this is a really pretty pink um, so if you guys have fun um, colors that you guys love to um where let me know i want to know what your favorite color is so drop it down don't be shy don't it's okay if you comment um on what colors you guys like as in a natural everyday color as the fall is coming we have this salted caramel which this is our old packaging our new packaging comes like this so it's been they've been um reformulated so they will um they're vegan they last longer the transfer is very minimal now so, and i like that right so i love so what color maybe the maybe one this one the salted this one or do you like this pink these are great when you have like great jewelry pieces also um i'm just into my jewelry piece that i won the other day so if you guys like um, the jewelry lady, she's actually on. Say hi, Deb. <laughs> but I'm going to uh, maybe Victoria. Which one do you like? Um, I'm going to go like a nude, but I can just change it up. But I'm going to do this color, this pink color. It's really pretty. And I'm just going to use one of these because I'm going to use... Oh, you want me to start with mauve? Okay, I'll start with mauve. Let me put this to the side so that I can start with this color that I love. 
this macaroon. Uh, macaroon is my favorite, you know, party over here. Let me make sure that I open up my, my wipe that I love to use. And I'm going to put macaroon. What I do with these, you guys, I actually take off some of the color because sometimes it's very bright like it goes on like a lot and you're just like oh my god this is too much product right so for that I also it's a doe foot so it's gonna lay right on top of your lips so I love that okay they last really long um, this is macaroon it smells like macaroon so it smells like all of our lip colors are dessert based so because they smell that way I honestly I'll tell you guys really quick that I start in the middle right here with all the product okay and you'll see that it's a doe foot and the reason for that it's great for when to be able to line your lips with these colors okay I start in the middle I don't start on the ends you know sometimes you naturally go this way all the product will end on this side so let's and remember I took some of it off and just so you guys know if you guys order any of these um, it's free shipping so this color is really nice it's an everyday color like you could actually use it on your cheeks if you wanted to use it on your eyes you could it really depends on how you want to use it so this is macaroon and just a little bit you guys saw that I did that right so it's just a little bit it's just a little bit I love this color because you can wear it with anything you can up play for my skin tone it looks more like um, like a nudish color with a little bit hint of I'll say more brown pinkish not pink bright pink obviously but more of a like a mauve color so this is like my favorite this is I use this every day so that was macaroon as you guys can see I'm using just a little bit and look at how much it came off already I will um, use my um, my buffer brush to even out my lips because of the color so I'm gonna go straight in Deb this is the one I gave you and you were like oh my god I love it so again I'm going to use just a little bit share this with your friends you guys free shipping so that's pretty amazing let me put this to side so again I start in the middle this color you guys is so pretty I'll show you guys um, how you can do um, what is that called like if you wanted two colors you wanted to do an ombre look again I started in the middle here so that all the color goes there and then I can just even it out A good another tip if you're wearing a bright color like this you want to make sure you smile because if you have a lot of cracks in your lips smiling will take that away um, some people don't realize that you can put lipstick on and then like you smile and you can see the cracks um, of your lips and that's just because some people have just extra skin so a little tip there and if you wanted to put a gloss over this you could this is such a pretty color I think it's great on all skin tones if you love pink this pink is called cupcake it smells like cupcake it makes you want to eat cupcakes so why not right who doesn't love hi Lucy hi Shirley so this color is cupcake and again when you put it on you want to if you put it on a lot, you guys, try to take your doe foot, um, your applicator, and just clean it off, and then put it on again um, to kind of even it out if you feel like you put too much. Or you can take a napkin and just blot it just slightly. I love this color. This color actually stays on me. 
probably about six hours because it's gonna be a little wet not wet like glossy wet but it'll be a little wet and then once it dries it doesn't dry out your lips so your lips will still stay moist um but i don't like that word moist um still moisturize <laughs> um so that's one thing that i love about these um that your lips don't dry out and so it's pretty you can like you can do a heavy eye and if you love pink lipstick or you can do like a light eye like I did and then do a pink lipstick like this. It, we also have eye eyeliners, lip liners um, that go with each color. Um, so that's pretty awesome too. Even with the lip liner, it can last longer. Um, I find that you don't even need to use a lip liner with these, honestly. I love these. I love, love, love. I love lipstick, but before I used to be like a lipstick wearer all the time. Um, and then I went from lipstick to like using these colors. So what color should I do next? So I did Macaroon. Hi, Patty. Um, I did a Cupcake. Um, let's do Creme Brulee. Creme Brulee is more on the pink side and just so you guys know the colors that if you order anything the new formula is slightly different but it gives you the same type of um idea of the color it might be a little darker or it might be a little lighter um but nothing this honestly will be pretty much the same color that you would get so i'm going to use an applicator And then this is creme brulee. This is a pretty color. Let's swatch it. I like this color too. I like them all. Again, starting in the front here. And a little tip if you feel like it might get on your teeth, you can actually take a napkin and just put it down like on that so then it cleans up this area one thing that you want to do if you find that your lipstick is not stained just in general um, do a little lip scrub a lip scrub always helps you don't want to waste any product, so just <laughs> get the applicator. But again, these will be yours. Um, and so you can just go ahead. All of them have a doe foot, which I like because it just makes it easier to line your lips with. Or if you want to do like a different color, so it really helps with that. And that was creme brulee. I love these colors, you guys. These colors are fun. And what I like about them is that you can... Um, use any lipstick that you want with these like if you wanted to use this with another color you could and my lips might um get a little dry only because i'm doing like swatching um if your lips are dry just another little tip if your lips are dry put a lip gloss like a um i use this which is called Paw Paw. You can get it at the Alcone store which is our parent company or you can get it at um, Lucas Paw Paw like any beauty store usually has them. Um, they come in like a lip size and then more like a squeeze but I find that using that a little bit prior to um, doing any lip application will actually help your lips stay moisturized. So this one is mine, so I'm going to use a doe foot. This is our Salted Caramel, perfect for fall. And it's more on the brown side, so if you're looking for a brown color, this is perfecto. They're super easy to use, you guys. They're not difficult. You don't have to do multiple coats if you don't want to. You just make sure you smile to get in the cracks. 
of your lips and there bam it makes it that easy right my lighting oh i better plug in my lighting before my ricky dies we don't want ricky to die no ricky don't die Ooh. so can you guys see that is it too bright i need to put like blinders on <laughs> So that is our salted caramel. Okay. So that's that. Again, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of foundation. If you're on, say hi. Mix it easy. Let's go in with wedding cake. Wedding cake tastes not taste but it actually um smells ex if you're a wedding cake lover you want to make sure you get this this has also a doe foot and this is more of a shimmery color so it's more on the pink side um i'm going to use this hi dean how are you is the lighting too bright and what's perfect is that these are also doe foot. So these are exactly what I would be using if it was. And I like this because it's real soft and simple. It makes it look like if you want a little bit of shimmer, you can. I'm going to show you guys by adding. I'm going to add... Um, like with this color, I'm gonna add a Believe, which is a lip gloss, so that you can see how they look with a lip gloss. And so if you wanted a lip gloss, we do have like a teen collection that actually comes with one of our lip glosses. So it's pretty, right? Like you can use it with or without. And then I just go like that. But make sure you're smiling when you're putting on your lipstick because you want to make sure that you get all in the crevices of your lips. Some people have wrinkles. Sorry, but we some people have wrinkles in your lips. So if you do, make sure you smile so that you get all of that in. So that was Believe with Wedding Cake. So you're going to believe that that wedding cake is on point. <laughs> so are you guys liking the colors? Let me know if you guys are liking the color, liking the colors. And I normally put a little bit of foundation on my lips only because sometimes I want to get the true color. Um, the true color of the actual lipstick. So the next color that I'm going to try is our angel food the light is bright so if you do lives you guys you guys need one of these lights <laughs> I just blind myself. Just blind myself. So look at how pretty that is. If you want to do like an ombre look, you could totally rock this with an ombre look. You can do, um, oh yeah, Deb, sorry, but some people do have it. And it's like, I hate to say it, but at the same time, they would wonder why I was saying to smile instead of saying, ooh, make sure you get the crevices. <laughs> So you can do it this way. You can, if you wanted to add like another color to this, you can add like sugar, um, salted caramel. And it can change the whole color of your lipstick, giving you like a new lip color. So if that's how you want to do it, or you can do the whole lip. and get it like on point with a different color. You can actually change the lip colors um, and make it your own color. So whether you put just a little bit or just a lot of it. 
Okay, I'll try it. I just tried it with the Believe, but I don't know if you were on, but I'll try it right now. So that was Angel Food. And I really like that color. Like, I like that color to, like, use more as a highlight for my lips. You can use also our concealers as a highlight. So Wedding Cake. Wedding Cake is this color. It's a pretty color. It has a little bit of a shimmer. It's, to me, it's more, um, it's not really like pink pink. It's more of a mauve color. So, with some shimmer. So what do you guys think? That's pretty, right? Like, if you were going out, you can, like, upscale it um, with a gloss, maybe, or even a lip liner. It really depends to me. I love this color only because um, it makes my lips look like I have color. I have a little bit of shimmer. Do you like it, Nadine? Mm. Do, you, do you like it? Do you like it? I'm <laughs> just kidding. So... Do you like it? Comment below if you like this. If you love it, give me a heart. This can be your everyday color. So, I like this color. It's pretty. Um, it's great, like if you do weddings, like if you're a makeup artist, you can do weddings with that color. You can be you know if you want something real soft for an event but you want like a strong eye that would be a color that you can actually get away with um to use so i'm gonna go ahead and use our cake pop this color is bomb you guys i love this color it's so pretty um and it smells like cake pops so how we do that Again, I'm going to start in the middle. Look, do you, this is just an example how much product that has on there. I'm going to show you. I'm going to get another um, applicator to show you that that much product will probably cover my whole entire lip. Okay. Oh, my phone keeps freezing at work. Bad reception. What color is that? That's pretty. This is Cake Pop. Remember how I told you guys a lot of the product will cover your lips? Mind you, I have big lips. Like, my lips don't take that much product, but they're big enough where I feel like they can take... Mind you, I'm barely... Look at how much... That's not even a lot of product. And it's covering enough to get the color payout you guys this color is and if you want to make it darker you just add it a little bit more and if you mess up if you feel like you messed up look at I still have a lot of product on this that I can easily, that's why I say when you're using the doe foot on your own application, you want to make sure that you're doing this because look at all that product that I just took off of there because that product will cover my whole lips. Like a little bit goes a long way. So I'll tell you guys that these will last you for a long time. And this is cake. I'm telling you guys, these colors are bomb. You can use them for cheek colors. You can use them for eye colors. It really depends on what you're going for, but you can use them for so many different ways. Like, you can do an ombre look. Should I do an ombre look? Let me show you guys. With this color, I'm going to add our angel food. I'm going to put a little bit on my hand because... 
how I am going to do it. I'm just going to dab it just in this area. And look at barely anything. And look at how it highlights your lips. So to me, when you use a color that's lighter, in this case, and if you feel like, oh, I want it to be a little more light, a little lighter, just take the doe foot, just a little bit, like literally that's probably, I feel like that's too much, but it's just an example. See, that's what I get for using my fingers instead of using a brush. See, I told you guys, my lives are not perfect. So, as you guys can see, and then you guys can blend it out with your doe foot of your lighter color. So there, you guys can use it this way or you can use it a different way. I'm going to actually do another color to show you guys a darker and a lighter color. So this is um, Angel Food with Cake Pop. I don't know what's wrong with my phone. Mm -mm -mm. yes and the reason why I'm doing it this way with foundation like taking out the color is to show you guys the true color because if I left my lips on the pink side it was still might be a brighter pink that then you guys think oh that's the color I want so next, I'm going to go into this. This is our Candy Apple, which is a great color. It's more of an orange tone. Um, so if that's the orange red you like, this is the color that you can get. I'm always having to... I'm into Again, I usually start with my top lip and a little bit of my bottom, and then I blend. Like, there's so many pretty colors that you can wear with so many different colors, like jewelry that is you know you can go ahead and match your jewelry with your lips and your clothes with your lips lips can play a big part in what you your makeup looks like so this is candy apple it's more of an orange red um so it's more like candy apple it, it smells like candy apple <laughs> so i have a few. Let me. I have to see if I have my other. Oh, I have my color that I wanted. Um, sugar plum. So I'm gonna use another favorite. Is um, cherry pie. If you love a red, I'm gonna tell you this blue red here is like bomb.com. I will tell you this is more of a blue red um, so if you like that um, like matte color um, ruby woo and colors like that then this is in that range and you see how I'm putting it on because 
I don't want it all to be at the end, so I'm going to use the lighter corner of the doe foot. So that it um, goes on. You can do it in one swipe, you know, or you can do it in several uh, with red. I tend to do it in multiple steps. Because I like that. Because I don't want it to bleed. I don't want it to do any of that unnecessary nonsense. So, this is this color, cherry pie. But what I am going to do is... I'm going to take our sugar plum and I'm going to make it an ombre. And I'm going to use when I tend to do an ombre I actually try to use like um, a lighter and a darker color. So in this case I'm going to use a darker on this side. And mind you, there's so many ways to do this. People, so many people do it different ways. Do it the way that you feel comfortable and not trying to talk. If you happen to get it where you're like, oh my god, I so messed up, don't worry. Just grab a little bit of your concealer um, or your foundation. I'm going to grab a doe foot. And fix it. This can be an easy fix. Or it can be a hard fix, so. So you can do it this way. You can get the red again and kind of even it out, like blend it. And look at how that looks it looks really pretty if you have like less makeup eye makeup to me it makes it look really pretty because then your lips stand out again make sure you smile and you can do it this way or you can do it the opposite way where it's all um, sugar plum with red on the top just how I did it um, but the opposite way it's super easy just know makeup is fun do not sweat it if you mess up okay like I'm gonna just show you how it can stain your lips um, so when it does come off it doesn't stain it to where it won't come off it just stains it to make it look like you have lipstick So to me, I love these colors. They're all easy to use. Sorry. To use. Get my, as you can see, look at how it makes my lips really red. And I'm gonna go in with the last color. And that is Sugar Plum. Sugar Plum is a great color. It's um, more of a plummy color, but it's really like vampy. Um, so I'm going to use and so I put a little bit on the bottom lip and then I go in with the top
I always have to check my fingers because you don't want to get the color everywhere. So, there. That is Sugar Plum. If you wanted to go darker, you could. If you didn't, that's okay too. I use the doe foot, so for me, I feel like I put a lot of product on. So, if you wanted to make it darker, you could. And then that is the final of all the colors that I have. There's one more color I didn't post that I didn't share um, because I don't have it. I think I lost it somehow. It must have fell under my car seat or something. So, look at how amazing these wipes are, you guys. I still have so much that I can take off. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys these lip colors. I hope you guys enjoyed the lip swatches. My name is Tina Hofstetter and I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for my replay watchers. If you're watching the replay, hashtag replay. And I hope you share this with your family and your friends. I truly appreciate it. Thank you guys. Bye.